My family is distilling in Europe since a long, long time. My grandparents had a farm. If you have a farm, you distill. And at a young age, I learned how to distill. At the time, I wasn't very happy about it, that I had to help, but I'm very glad now that I did pay attention. Uh, I make vodka, plain vodka, flavored vodka, and of course, my favorite, the gin. But all natural ingredients, no artificial flavors, no chemicals, no funky sugars. And the maple vodka, of course, that's uh, the, the big favorite of everybody. I know the outcome most of the time, they're skeptical of maple liquor, oh my, and then they try it and eyes open and they go, mmm. Uh, you spend the money in Nova Scotia, uh, the money stays in Nova Scotia and the economy here. Why should I buy uh, cherries coming from California for say, uh, what look pretty, what don't taste right. Uh, strawberries I buy here from Van Adams Berry Farm, yes they're small, they don't last long, but they taste fantastic. Normally they're on the plant and the next day they're here. The biggest supporter I would say the people of Nova Scotia, like the community, the you know people who come here, people who like my stuff, and I can see that they really like it when they lick out the tasting cup. <laughs>